Hey guys, what's up? It's me, your boy, uh, Teddy Yersa. And yeah, as you can see here, guys, uh, the weather is kind of cloudy. And yes, uh, it might rain soon. And yeah, guys, um, how's your weather out there? I can post down in the comment section below for your weather along with the current time zone that you are currently in. So, uh, guys, right now, what I'm going to share to you is a uh, method that will help you learn fast and effective yes I have a story before guys where I was still studying and yeah I used to write down some notes on the subject that I was learning and yeah I remember during that time that whenever there was a test um, I I studied the night before and I used to cram a lot and taking huge, huge loads of information on the data time, the idea, the statistics on the topic and when the test happened, uh, it seems that I found it hard to answer the test and also um, I remember during the time when I had my first job interview where I used to prepare I used to prepare on the different questions uh, before the interview and when the interview happened um, I noticed that the questions were unexpected so uh, guys um, what I did here was it seems that I had a shallow learning on the on the topics instead of having a deeper understanding on the different topics that I I supposed to be prepared on since the method that I was the method of learning that I performed during that time was scrumming and yes um, with the method that I am going to share to you guys right now uh, this method is developed by a physicist which is Richard Feynman he yeah uh, he is a physicist who, who win a Nobel a Nobel Prize for his work in quantum electrodynamics and he also is the first to develop to introduce the concept of nanotechnology um, with his method, this will help us um, study and learn new subjects and yeah, um, have a deeper understanding on the subject that you want to learn. And also, it will help you prepare, prepare for a job interview or prepare yourself for a test. And with this method, this is a four-step process. Uh, mental mo model and yes um, this is this method is also used by Richard Feynman in his study in his university and yes uh, for this technique uh, this is called the Feynman technique and for the first for the first method or the first step uh, this is to identify the subject I can identify any subject that you want to learn and you can gather all all types of data or materials that is needed for you to learn a specific topic you can gather anything books materials articles and you study on them and yes for the step two this is where you write them you write them down and explain it to a child yeah uh, with this step uh, you need to write down the, the topic that you have learned and imagine that you are explaining it to, to a child uh, with this method uh, this will help you analyze and and check if you have learned on this specific topic by making the topic easy to 
easy to discuss as a child will easy and easily understand on it so um this step uh, you need to keep the information simple and you need to avoid to avoid jargons and yeah uh, for example water yeah um very just simple simple description for water a uh, water is a tasteless odorless liquid and if you are going to explain it with jargon um, you can explain it like this it is a chemical compound which is composed with hydrogen and oxygen in a covalent bond so um with step two you need to explain it as simple as possible as you are explaining to a child for the step three uh, this is to identify the gaps in your learning this is where you need to check on the gaps on the subject that you are trying to learn example in water um, you will ask yourself uh, what are the benefits and what will happen if you <laughs> you are dehydrated or something like that you need to dive into deeper deeper understanding on the on the topic that you want to learn and with this this will help you check on yourself if you you have learned on it or not since this will help you identify what you have learned and what you haven't so um once you have identified the gaps in your knowledge you will be able to study more more on it you you can strengthen the knowledge and idea on the topic that you wanted to learn and yes um for this step four this is where you repeat the step one two three so um, once you have identified the gaps in your knowledge uh, you need to gather to gather more on the specific information that you had got in you can check some books you can check some articles you can research more on your materials then you will try to explain it explain it more in simpler terms as you are explaining it to a child and yeah um, you need to check and identify if there are any more gaps in the knowledge and then once you keep you keep repeating the process one two three uh, you will be able to master it and yes uh, that is the that is the step four and with step four you can also write down a script write down the script on what you have learned since you will write the topic on a piece of paper you can explain it loud and clearly or you can talk when you are writing as you are explaining it to someone that does not know the topic yet and yes um, you will be able to master it by repeating the step one two three and yeah um, with with this method this is very beneficial since it is a mutual process where as as you teach a topic to someone it will also be beneficial for you since this is a highest form of learning since when you teach a topic to someone you can also learn on it since you will dedicate more time to to study on this on this specific material that you wanted to learn yeah uh, this is very effective since you you just need to identify on a idea that you want to learn and then you just teach it teach it to someone and yes um, with the Feynman method, uh, I'll repeat back the, the first step process of this method. The first step is to identify the topic. The second step is to write, write it down and imagine that you are 
explaining or teaching it to a child. The third step is to identify the gap in your learning. And the fourth step is to repeat the step one to step three. And yes, uh, thank you so much guys for your time in listening to one of the method to help help you learn fast and effective. Thank you so much and please like and subscribe on my channel so that I can continue to make more uh, videos and thank you guys and enjoy, enjoy watching. You have a wonderful day. Bye now.